My work to date has been about combining the hand-drawn line and the intuitive gesture with um, different types of algorithms and computational technologies. And that's turned into uh, investigation into human and robot collaboration, thinking about, you know, what's the next stage of the interface today? I've done a number of things at Bell Lab. In recent years, my work has been in video analytics, and I'm trying to expand the applications from simply public safety to interactiveness and to, to art. I have no expertise in art, and so when the Artists in Residence program at Bell Labs began, I was thrilled because now this was a partnership. I could provide what I knew how to do, and these artists would have new and wonderful and very different ideas than I had even uh, conceived. I became really interested in Larry's background off the bat. He creates visual algorithms that are applied to public cameras, and that really triggered my thinking about how I could use that as a way to extract behavior from an urban setting into something that I could paint with. The security cameras have had a long history. What I'm doing differently, I'm sort of dumbing down the problem. Instead of looking at each individual out there, I'm looking at crowds. And if something happens, a crowd will react to that collectively. And since it's bigger, video analytics can more reliably recognize that. What I'm doing with Omnia for Omnia is I've collected I've been calling it the biometrics of the city, but what it essentially is, is the general optical flow of the city through Bell Labs motion engine. And I've translated that behavior into robotic movement that functions as a gesturally motion on the canvas. When I first met Su Gwen, I loved the line of her art. And Ultimately, I don't think it's about the technology. I think that we, the technologists, facilitates the artist. And I'm learning something from them, and they're learning something from me. What makes collaboration really interesting is that there's a lot of give and take and vulnerability that's required in it, and a lot of trust. And it becomes a lot more than the work. It's about you know the energy between people and human and machine alike. And I think a lot of the work is reflective of that. It has informed me, broadened my own thoughts. You know, I'm a re researcher, I'm supposed to be creative uh, as, as well, but perhaps one is creative in a constrained way, and they allow me to think outside of this universe in a very different way.